Yasas Apudin Lava. Josh the Oracle here, welcoming you to Greece. Perched high above the Corinthian Gulf, I am seated in the town of Delphi. That's right, Delphi, not Delphi. Home to the infamous ancient oracle, as well, of course, as the Delphi technique some of us are all too familiar with back in California. And another interesting fact about this ancient town, as I give you a look at the incredible view of the Corinthian Gulf and the town of Delphi perched high up on this beautiful hill. Um, just a couple minutes ago, I was watching some Roger Federer tennis, part of the 2012 Olympic Games. Did you know that Delphi hosted one of the four Panhellenic Games, the precursor to the modern Olympics? And this bread and circus routine keeps on keeping on. A few days ago, I was visiting the Roman Colosseum, taking a tour inside of what once played host to the ultimate bread and circus show. A couple weeks ago, I was hanging out at Stratford Park, excuse me, Olympic Park in Stratford. If you haven't caught that video, take a look at the free slow report from London. And just now, I was watching the 2012 Olympics from one of the original four hosts of the Olympics two, more than two millennia ago. And you do not need an oracle to figure out that Bread and Circus helps keep a population at bay, as the Bay Laurel is uh, well apparent in this area. But it keeps population check. Bread and Circus is what allows elites to control population. When people are happily distracted, they are not often checking on what's going on in the world, like the crashing Greek economy, or the Eurozone crisis, or whatnot. But more to come on that in the very near future. I will be visiting you from Athens. We will talk plenty about this country that is oh so rich in history, and oh so swirling in controversy at the moment. All right, that's a wrap from Delphi. Have a great night. I'm going to enjoy mine.